everyone, it's Kevin from Balks to You, and this is going to be an update on the pastel spot nose to ultramel clutch. Obviously, we've got all their heads, uh, however, I'll just explain a few things um, with the ultramel gene. Uh, there isn't much out there in the UK regarding heads, so if there's a particular project that you want to do. Basically, it's probably best if you make your own heads because I don't see many people working with a gene. So first out of the gate uh, is a little normal. Obviously, everything in this clutch is 100% het for uh, Ultramel. Um, for those who have questions about the Ultramels, I do get asked. Um, it's not the same thing as Caramel. It's completely different. It does not kink. It does not have problems regarding fertility issues or anything like that. Uh, otherwise I wouldn't be having these babies and these have come from a female ultramel. So there's one out of the gate, that's a female. Hit two normals on this clutch, uh, here's the second. This one too is a female. Yep. Yeah. So there's the second normal female. Hit two pastels in this clutch. <clears throat> what I tend to find with pastel het ultramels um, is it does tend to whack out the pattern. Uh, and they do tend to get very bright with age. Uh, I have a few pastel heads and they are uh, very bright. Um, the only thing I can think of is it's down to the het for uh, the, being het ultramel, which is obviously the ultramel is displaying some characteristics in het form. So. There's a little male. <clears throat> second pastel that too is a male then I absolutely love these these are the spot nose heads those who've been watching and following my videos know that I've been uh, producing some spot nose combos this year uh, just because I do think it's a really underrated uh, morph again very bright dorsal stripe um, this one this one is a male Here is spot nose number two. This one's very much darker on the sides. As you can see, that back stripe is very bold and very bright. So one thing you don't see a lot of is spot nose ultramels. Love the head stamp on this guy. And yes, it is a guy. I've already checked this one. Really crazy bellies. And then the last one was a pastel spot nose. very bright again got a feeling it's obviously down to the influence of the um, being het ultramel 
the spot nose genie is very bright anyway you start adding it into combos and it does become really bright so yeah that was just a quick update uh, I'll tell you what I'll do I'll show you guys a yearling so bear with me this guy for those who remember last year I hatched he is the pastel ultramel and again what well, I don't really need to say anything do I really guys I mean you can see the colors really pop vibrant colors I mean beautiful blushing this guy is absolutely stunning I can't get over how much people don't work with the Ultramel especially in the UK guys you must know your ultra miles because I have seen certain people trying to sell um, caramels as ultra miles and they're not there is a distinguished difference between the two I don't have caramel so I can't really show you guys but trust me you'll know a caramel when you see it and caramels are beautiful in their own rights uh, but they are nothing when it comes down to an ultra mile. So expect some more Ultramel combos from me. Oh, this dude's active. So I'll leave you guys with that. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed the update. Again, this guy will be in action this uh, coming breeding season. So there will be plenty more Ultramel projects coming out of the HQ. Okay, everyone. Hope you're all okay. Take care. And I'll speak to you guys soon.